So if he dies, am I gonna stop getting royalties from his books? Because if so, that is really sad. Hello and welcome back to my legacy challenge of pain, suffering, and stress. <laughs> to quickly catch you up, we've only played five episodes, but we're playing on a short lifespan, so everything is happening like this and I can't keep up. So if you missed last episode, I'm gonna link it down below. Please go watch it because everyone is older now. <laughs> and if you didn't see it, everyone's gonna die and you're not gonna know how. But let's game, shall we? Do you know what? I feel like it's hilarious looking at my house in this neighborhood because we live across the street from the land grabs. And so our house looks so small and there's a rocket ship. Like it's just something is off about that to be honest. <laughs> I am so sorry. Look look at her. She's so sad because I forgot her birthday. Oh, uh, when she turns into a teenager, we have to have a big party, okay? We need to like make this girl some friends and we need to have a big party when it's her birthday because I feel terrible. I literally missed her and her mom's birthdays last episode. So we have some work to deal with next episode because I feel really bad. <laughs> at least she can help take care of the cat. It's helpful to have another sim around these parts that can help us out with that stuff because before I was neglecting the cat. I know, it was not good. Luckily that was rebate day that we spent all that money on, so we should get some money back. What are you doing up at 4 a.m.? <sighs> <laughs> this is terrible. And she's eating cake. You know what? Waking up at 4 a.m. to eat cake alone the day after your entire family forgot your birthday. That, that is really sad, but honestly, it's kind of a mood. I've never had that happen to me. I'm not often awake at this hour. <laughs> Are you crying in your sleep? Oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, you know what? This is just mean. I know what I did was wrong. I'm trying to fix it. You guys, you don't have to keep rubbing it in. Okay, she needs to work on her handiness skill for her aspiration. Can I upgrade anything at all? I need some more upgrade parts. Oh, I have an alien to sell. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe we could purchase some common upgrade parts. I'll buy like eight of them. That's how much money I, I got from my alien. So <laughs> it's probably worth it. Oh, speaking of which we could breed frogs. Maybe we could use our frog money to buy upgrade parts. <laughs> the fact that this is all I do in this series, you're really watching me breed frogs for 20 minutes. Like that's what this let's play is. All right, I'm sending the, the fiance over here out. He's gonna do some digging at 6 a.m. Oh, he's gonna pee his pants. Why is everyone awake so early? Yeah, I feel bad that I've done this to my Sims. Like genuinely, I, I do. I bought some more upgrade parts again. I'm upgrading these things to have water recyclers. I feel like it's worth it. I don't know. I just, she needs to work on her handiness skills. So we might as well just upgrade stuff and like hope for the best. This area looks weird in the fall. <laughs> in my experience uh, in Florida, which is not the desert. So, you know, take it with a grain of salt. But in my experience in Florida, our trees don't really turn color. <laughs> um, The palm trees don't die in the fall like <laughs> this this feels a little bit odd to me like we're green all year round in these parts obviously this is the desert it's dry it's not the same but it is a bit weird <laughs> to see the the trees turning like this I don't usually play in Oasis Springs I don't even think I realized that this happened okay I successfully had Dylan go and collect everything so that's good oh I didn't even realize the kid had school I thought it was a weekend <laughs> oops it's okay <laughs> she's fine she went to school she's fine I think we should have her make a club. Obviously, like, this is kind of a weird situation because she's only gonna be a child for like a second, but I think that making a club of kids in the neighborhood is a good idea. But before I do that, last episode I asked you guys to make me a bunch of sims that we could place in the world to have like more friends and stuff, and I think that now is a good time for us to go add those sims. I'm gonna evict a bunch of the like townies, the one- like Elphaba lives here. These houses have like- oh, look, I'm, I'm about to evict baby Ariel. <laughs> But I know you guys made me a bunch of sims. <gasps> this one's got a puppy. Oh no, I like these people. The green family, Jonathan and Ayla. <gasps> my name's Kayla. <laughs> it might be Isla, Ayla, I don't know. But my name's Kayla, so I'm gonna go with Ayla. <laughs> this is by T Ludwig4487. You may think that Tanya and Alec are too different to be happily married, but with Tanya's passion for business and Alec's pro parenting skills, their household runs like clockwork. The twins, Jonathan and Ayla, seem to have a good mix of both their parents, but will everything remain smooth sailing or is something inevitably going to go wrong? <gasps> well, I hope not. All right, let's stick them in this place over here. I like these Sims by Starstruck Star as well. They've got like mom, grandma, and two daughters. <laughs> I don't think they have enough space in the house I'm putting them in, but um, <laughs> oh well. <gasps> oh, this Sim is pregnant. Oh, that's good. This is by Ginger Cat Fam. Oh, and they're a kind of blended family because these two daughters have a different dad than this guy, but she's pregnant. Oh, I like that. And they've got a cat. <laughs> I like this. I'm glad that we have a lot of sims here. <laughs> I'm glad it's a big family. I should have been commenting on these ones that I'm picking, shouldn't I? <laughs> Whoops. <gasps> Ooh, single mom Skyla, my name's Kayla. <laughs> Let's place them in here. Ooh, Andre is the son of a famous movie star. <laughs> 
Well, let's place them in the neighborhood. <laughs> They've got a cat named Ladle. <laughs> I want to take these people. I like these people and their kids are adopted. That's kind of fun There are a lot of them <laughs> A lot of children that we can have. It's just nice to have more sims in the town, you know, okay It looks like I'll add two more households. Ooh, more kids. Okay. Let's place these people in here. They're gonna <laughs> The house is tiny. It doesn't fit them. They have a dog named noodle Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna place this family purely because of the dog. I'm sure the sims are really nice too, but I didn't even look at them. I fill up Oasis Springs. I'll definitely add more sims in the future. I think that right now we should probably like just keep ones around our age at the moment because we're all gonna age up soon. So like we're gonna need some more sims soon anyway. Everybody's gonna die and we're gonna have to replace them. So feel free to continue to make sims for hashtag look little simsy. Like I said, we're gonna need a few. <laughs> I just placed a couple Maxis lots down from my library as well. I couldn't be bothered to search the gallery for like a library and a, a bowling alley, so I just put the default ones. But we can always update that later. That's the fun part. We've got years and years ahead of us to update this save file. Oh, I forgot I was in a club. <laughs> Oh, since when? There's like nothing else in this house that I can even upgrade. <laughs> oh, here we go. Self-cleaning. Oh, and a bidet. Yeah, I need you to do all of these things because I need you to get your skill up. <laughs> Sorry. And we can sell all this stuff that he's got on him here. That's not bad. We're doing okay. I feel bad that on her day off, she just has to sit at home and like upgrade our sad appliances. <laughs> but to be fair, she works like every other day. So every day is a day off for her. Ooh, GeekCon is in town. And we finished our aspiration. Level 10 logic skill, fix or upgrade five object. <laughs> well, that is quite the task. <laughs> Okay. Well, we have some work to do apparently. Maybe we should go to GeekCon though. I feel like that could be genuinely useful for us. We should probably eat at home before we go though. <laughs> we got food at home. <laughs> we don't need to go buy food there. Oh yeah, she's fine. Let's go. I really like the festivals in this game. Things like GeekCon and like all the city living stuff. It's just fun how like the world changes a little bit and there's like an event that pops up occasionally. Ooh, and we can work on building the rocket here. We'll get skill up for free. That's good stuff right there. See? <laughs> we still need to work out for work, which I haven't done yet. I guess we can do it all. We can do both things here. <laughs> I do like GeekCon though, it's fun. <laughs> Maybe we can explore space for a second. Look, Dustin Broke is working with us. He's a celebrity. We got stars all over the place. <gasps> Belle's done with school for the day. What if she came here to GeekCon? I know she's not like the most interested in this stuff, but maybe we could play a game. Like you could play Party Frenzy at GeekCon while your mom's here. And speaking of which, I'm gonna just call it Scouts. It's not actually Scouts, but this way it's like an easy way to make a kids club. <laughs> and we'll just add some children from the town. I don't know who to pick. Skyla, how about Jensen and Jeannie? Rita, Gabriella, John? Jonathan. Oh, I can't add Jonathan. <laughs> Maybe just one of these siblings could be added. We'll get Jonathan. That's a good idea. Okay, that's a decent set of friends. Maybe they can be friendly to people. <laughs> that could be their club trait. I don't know. It's just a way for us to meet some other kids because we don't actually know anybody. And now she like knows a bunch of Sims, <laughs> which makes our life easier. Oh, the rocket's almost done being built. That's good. Oh, is that me? That is me in space. Okay. <laughs> that kind of scared me. Who's calling you? Miriam, I'm busy. Oh no, look at how stinky my kid is. <laughs> okay, maybe we, maybe we should go back home. And she's cold, oh no. Yeah, now's probably a good time for us to return home. We went to GeekCon, we worked on our skills. Stunk up the place a little bit, but that's okay. <laughs> Wait, is my roof messed up? Do you see, did I never change it? Oh no, now I feel embarrassed. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm an idiot. How did I do that? Oh, that that is honestly Kayla That is really something you should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> How did I mess it up that bad? Okay Well, like I said, it's fixed now and that's all that matters <laughs> That is really quite something. Okay. Yeah, Belle You should come here and you should shower because you do not look great Maybe now's a good time to work on our fitness skill too because we need to do that for work and our logic skill like this is so sad She has so much to do this poor woman is just busy all of the time Time. It's okay, at least we make 104 simoleons per hour. 104 days of summer vacation, you know? Somebody in the comments last week was saying how they think that maybe Belle could become a teacher, and I liked that idea a lot. They were like, maybe Belle could be a teacher because her parents neglect 
her. And I was like, oh my god, that is so sad. They're doing their best. Maybe somebody should help her with her homework. Oh, we should do that. Hey, that's a good idea. But you know, her mom is a genius. She's like basically following in mom's footsteps. It kind of works. You have to work out more. How much more do you have to work out? Anyway, I feel like it makes sense. <laughs> Even if it, you know, isn't the best. She wants to play on a jungle gym while playful. Maybe tomorrow we can go to the park. Oh, we'll go to the park with the neighbor kids. Send the club over there. That's actually a really good idea. Because then she can do her jungle gym thing. And she can also meet the kids, the other kids. Because we need to do that. I like how Spatula is just sitting there. I wonder, is there a way that we can make Spatula meet that other family's cat named Ladle? <laughs> because I would like that. Are you going to bed at 9 p.m.? No, no, no. Go to the bathroom first at least. Oh, God. I feel bad. <laughs> These poor kids. All right. She completed her workout. So now we can go to bed. Oh, I guess she's close to getting her skill up. But that's fine. We'll, we'll figure that out next day. This wasn't so bad. Sure, I didn't do a great job today, but we made a lot of progress. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, the tacos. I didn't put them in the fridge. Oh, that would have been bad. We can't afford to be wasting money from tacos. We don't have much taco money here. Like 18 simoleons is a lot, okay? <laughs> At least mom's gonna go to work today. Did you break it? No. It broke something. Why does some- It made a broken sound. Okay, you need to take a shower. Work at 6 a.m. 6 to 4 p.m. That's really unpleasant. <laughs> I do not envy you. Why does he always just sit and play chess? That's what your girlfriend needs to be doing. Are they engaged or not? I keep saying girlfriend, partner. Engaged. They are engaged. We were gonna get married now that the kid's a kid. Which- Honestly, we could do that on Saturday. Do you work on Saturdays? No, you don't. Oh, we should get it. Let's get married on Saturday. He won't die by then, right? Ah! <laughs> he might. Oh no. Oh, wait a minute. Oh no. Okay. We might need to rethink that plan. No, he'll be fine. He'll live to Saturday. It's Wednesday. Is that risky? Is that too risky? Short lifespans are scary. I don't know. I didn't realize it was- I didn't realize this was happening so fast. What are we gonna do? Hey, I'm- I feel really bad. So if he dies, am I gonna stop getting royalties from his books? Because if so, that is really sad. Look at the cat. This thing is so scary looking. Harvest Fest? Headachey? Oh, I feel that. <laughs> I've been sick and having a headache all week too. Me and you both, Amber. Me and you both. No, she's not gonna do well at work. Oh, Dylan wrote a book, so that's good, I guess. Jaina? <gasps> I've called to inform you that your great great grand second once removed cousin's friend's grandpa has passed away and for some reason has left a vast fortune specifically to you. Will you accept under what conditions? <gasps> 2,500 more simoleons? We could upgrade our house. Let's upgrade our house. I'm gonna buy better appliances. <laughs> Maybe I'll even get better counters because they'll look nicer. <laughs> oh, that is quite the improvement. Are you guys seeing this? It's like a different house. House. Oh, it is so nice to finally have like decorations in the kitchen. I know that feels ridiculous to say, but like that, it, that's what's happening. Like it's so nice to finally have things. Can I afford a better TV? 1900? Not yet. Once, once mom gets home from work, we can do that. That looks so much better. That's like worlds better. <laughs> okay, now that we're home from school, we were gonna go to the park today. I'll have her do her homework really, really fast. 1040 from work. Yes. Thank you. Let's get a better TV. Okay. Oh, let's buy the good one. Honestly, just go all out. I'm feeling a lot better now. The house is really beginning to improve. <laughs> We're gonna go to the park and start a gathering with the club and hopefully meet some of the other kids because we don't have any friends. And I promised that I would give this poor child a party when she becomes a teenager. So this is the least I can do. Oh, look, Skyla's already here. Maybe we can goof around with Skyla. We play Space Explorer together. My Sim's not in a playful mood. <laughs> look at how many kids are here. Oh, and a you're gonna die. Vlad's gonna die. He's just out in the sun. Oh, Vlad. Oh. He disappeared. I don't- What are you? Who are you? I don't like it here. <laughs> I'm scared. I wanna see if some of these kids wanna be my friends. I'm trying to do playful interactions, but it's not working. <laughs> how do I make my sim playful? Okay, Google. How do I make my sim playful? Oh, I could've watched comedy on TV. Is there a TV in this room? There's a vampire in this room. <laughs> Watch channel comedy. Here, come on. We probably should be going to bed, but this is what we have to do until she gets playful really fast so I can play on a jungle gym. Does it work on children? <gasps> yes! See, that wasn't so hard. Yes! Okay, I spent all day here for that. Um, <laughs> but it's fine. Didn't realize that my social interactions wouldn't help. So now I know 
I don't even think Skyla likes me much because I was trying to like invite her to fake parties and trick her with a hand buzzer and stuff and that's not good. I just like unlocked a memory. I used to have a mod that if you use the trick with a hand buzzer interaction, it killed your sims. Like you, you would like shock them to death if you had the hand buzzer in your hand. <laughs> Why did I have that mod? <laughs> and tomorrow is Harvest Fest, so we can celebrate that holiday. At least dad will make it to that holiday. He won't make it past Harvest Fest probably, but <laughs> at least we can celebrate- ah! His bar is full! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> He's gonna die. This isn't fair. That's not fair. How is that fair? Why did he wake up? Is he always- oh, why, why is your energy full? This is terrifying. I hate short lifespan. I feel so scared all of the time. He's not even gonna make it to their wedding. Maybe we should get married tomorrow. I guess nobody's gonna have work or school because it's Harvest Fest. Yeah, honestly team, I think that we probably should. I think we should have a wedding. I know I keep going back and forth between like, should they ever get married? Should they not get married? But like, I want them to have one good romantic family day. <laughs> You know? <laughs> I don't know. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna end the part right here. I'm scared. I'm scared that he's gonna just die. <laughs> I mean, now that the bar is full, he could literally die at any moment. Oh my God. Okay, save the game. I'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I know I keep saying it, but short lifespan is scary. It's only episode six and my Sims are all gonna die. <laughs>